Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the new safe hour. We are jumping in again and we are gonna go and do a run. Uh, we'll do a normal run. Uh, definitely do a tainted character here. Um, tainted Azazel, that would be Beast or Greedier. I kind of don't... I'm, I'm feeling a mother run. Maybe we'll do Tainted Eden uh, to mother. See how that goes. Obviously this guy, quite the, uh, quite the crazy fella. Uh, we started out with Loki's horns. We've also started out with a space prime I've never seen before. On death, enemies may drop curse trinkets with negative effect. Curse trinkets auto smell and pick up. On you steals one fire damage and sells every curse. Oh, that's kind of interesting. That's kind of interesting. So basically, it's the ability of um, what's its name, uh, Tainted Mammoth. Um, as a character, which is kind of interesting. Uh, although I'm, I'm not sure if the damage will count as reroll damage or not, because if it does, then we only get one use of it. Now, this is pretty spicy here as well. Good start so far. Good start so far. So yeah, basically the decision is, do we actually want to try and use this active item, or is it a bit too big of a risk, and we'd rather keep what we have and have what we keep? Either way, as for... Don't even know what happened there. Um, oh, I have a smelted brown nugget for some reason. Um, or whatever the hell that trinket's called. Blasting cap, is it called? And I accidentally blew myself up with the poop. Good. <laughs> good, good, good. That is uh, not at all what I, um, what I expected to happen there, but it is what happened. Little bit annoying. Jacob's Ladder. You will, you will be missed. You will be missed. So do I just have that permanently smelted now? Why is that smelted? What's the, what's the deal with that? Is that to do with the trinkets mod or is that something else? I don't know. I kind of want to restart and check because I don't, if that's the case, I do not like that. Do you know what? I, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Okay. No, it, we get a random smelted trinket. Oh, that is interesting. Okay. We get a random smelted trinket. I'm not going to keep the fortune one because I know people hate watching that. Um, there you go. Health up. Okay, we got void this time around here. We got that trinket that changes into other random trinkets. Although when it's smelted, it doesn't tell you what trinket it's changed into. So I'm a little bit unaware of what we currently have going on right now. I am completely unaware. But anyways, a few restarts in. Uh, get a key here. A little bit annoying to get to, but oh well. I don't know why I'm bothering to do this. It just seems, yeah, like I gotta say, it seems like it might be worthwhile and it ended up being pretty worthwhile. A lot of extra bombs coming our way now. I like that. You're the big tail motherfucker, aren't you? Yep. Okay, I downgraded you with the item that I have there, which is rather nice. Um, not quite sure. Okay, the trinket must be giving us some stats there, because otherwise I have no idea where they're coming from. Yeah, that was pretty much bound to happen in that scenario. Um, apparently we have emoji glasses for this room. I'm guessing that's again a, tr a trinket effect I'm otherwise unaware of. I can handle it. Seems intriguing. Oh, this, this, this goober needs to move... Hey, we get Grimbum. We could potentially get some good uh, uses out of him before he disappears. Grimbum. Is it Grimbum? Is that what it's called? Reaperbum. That's the one. But yeah, he can give us some pretty good stuff. He's already given us a Wisp here. Oh, wait. Maybe maybe this uh, this trinket gives us a random item per room, not a random trinket. Because 404 is random trinket. So this, is, this is just a random item. Could be, could be quite good. Could be quite good. Okay, so this guy's going to be a little annoying. I'm going to use a bomb here to save us some time. Get him into the second phase makes him a hell of a lot easier for us to deal with. Easy peasy, lovely stuff. I'm going to try and do mother, so let's go this way straight away, shall we? Um, I will waste a bomb for a, a key to make sure I have item room on the next floor. I think that's worthwhile enough. But yeah, question of the day today. Um, what's a song you've recently discovered that you're really, really into? Or a band or an artist. Any any of those would be really intriguing to know. Boom. Ba -dum. 
Do, 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 do. Yeah, definitely want to get rid of that dude. Hope you gave me a card this time. Moon, I'll pop it. Prevents curses from appearing for the rest of the run. Preventing a curse gives you a damage increase. I mean, for right now, it's good. Also, it's a secret room item, which I think... I, I can't remember with Tainted Eden if it remembers the item quality or just the item pool. I think it's just the item pool, which means we could get a secret room pool item there, which is good for us going forward. Very good indeed. We do have a, a red rock there as well. Burn heart. See, this is why this guy, I want to keep him around for as long as possible. He can he can give you a lot of really good stuff. And then here, we've got more bombs or random. <sighs> Unfortunately, I took random and got a bomb that I'm not too particularly happy with, but eh. He now exists. He exists and he will steal our keys, I'm sure. Can this creep go away, please? Thank you. But then that guy has a lot of health. Got a bit of devil deal protection here, which is nice. Unfortunately, didn't get too much done with that. This guy's going to start skating around the room in a second. He's slowed for some reason. I think we have, like, stopwatch maybe or something in this room. Everything feels a little bit slower. Maybe it's just really laggy from all the rain. It's kind of hard to tell. Random battery. Technically, that is a random card, so I kind of get why we got that. There you go. A bar of soap is good stuff. Devil deal. I don't know. Devil deal. Do we go devil deal? I don't really think so. I think the uh, the cost of HP is a little too much for us right now. Which heads to the next floor with a head held pretty high. Onto the boiler as well. Lovely boiler. But yeah, this this arrangement of items I'm pretty happy with to keep for a little while here. Especially when we're getting random items thrown in here and there. I'm not particularly enjoying the insane amount of steam you guys are producing right now. It's it's a little much to keep track of, but hey her. Um yeah, seems decent enough. And we'll crack this open in case we had a soul heart. You never know, you do get soul hearts from them reasonably often. I'm just gonna use this at this point, it's a little easier. Good, good. I think secret room's above us there, but we are, we need two bombs this floor, so I'm not going to gamble on that right now. While I've got the soul hearts and stuff, let's try and get our uh, thingy to spawn. Angel deal is what I'm talking about here. Okay, it should be diving on through in any second. No? Okay, there you go. Nice and easy. Not a bad fight at all. Can you get over here, little lad? There you go. We did indeed get our angel deal as well. Very, very nice. And we get ourselves some Jesus juice, which is good because we get two of them. Um, which means we get two angel deal things that can reroll into other angel deal things. That's that's pretty goddamn useful. Um, we still we've got our second bomb now. Let's uh, let's double bomb this before we forget and end up using our bombs elsewhere because you know what I'm like. Um, so we've got that open now. Now let's uh, quickly do our mirror room and all that jazz. And we'll keep on keeping on. We got f so in this room we've got fruitcake. It's unfortunate that with it, with it being smelted you can't see what it's giving you. Because normally in the trinket slot it shows you what you're getting. But we're not, we're not getting that ability right now. Where's our white fire room? All the way over there. Okay. And grab that bomb as well once we uh, touch our white fire. Rather nice. I didn't actually see it here earlier. Probably should have done. Right, I'll grab that bomb. Thank you, thank you. And we will head into our mirror room and see what we can get done. With Spectral, these rooms become a lot easier, I, I think. I can't actually remember where item room is, so you're going to have to hold up while I try and figure that out. Okay, oh, yes, it's here. Uh, what was that, boss? Uh, honestly, it's um, the thingy version of um, Wormwood. I'm not particularly confident on his patterns. So I'm just going to leave. I am also going to bomb my mirror once I've left to get more reflected items. Constantly forget to do that, and it's very, very useful. 
We already saw that we got Jesus Juice reflected there. I mean, typically you're not going to find many items that are reflected. It's more so going to be um, consumables and stuff, but I still think that's really good. Um, right, so we're going up through here. No combat in here. Good. That was a tinted rock up there, I think, but I don't have a bomb, so... Don't matter anyways. Don't even have enough money to buy a bomb, so no matter what, it was useless to us. Lovely. Extra key as well. Nice. Wow, our items have really been bad so far, but the relic... Our other items, our um, hidden ones, have been pretty decent. Yeah, I'm not going to have you herming shot me, please. Dark with purple fires is a little scary. You're a little scary as well, to be fair, my good guy. You uh, spread quite a lot of detritus around the room. Don't know if I much stand for that. Okay. We've got Kidney Stone in here. Okay, unfortunate I got hit. Kidney Stone kind of wrecked me a little bit there. Got Eye of Greed, whatever it's called. Celestial Berry. I'm going to quickly jump in here. Bomb. Ah, that's not really what I meant to do. <laughs> but I got some money out of it anyways. <laughs> Oops. Worthwhile. Yeah, I've got that item that makes our shots explode after a certain distance. I, I don't particularly like it, to be honest. Thank you. Crack that open. Uh, if I can get 15 cent and keep this build around, then I can um, potentially work on... Getting something out of what's it called? Out of stairway, but I don't know if we're going to be able to do that. We'll have to see. That was terrible. What a what an awful throw. That's a bit better. I was hoping for some more obvious ways of getting some money here, but... I can't remember what these guys do. Some sort of chain lightning effects. With Eye of Greed, I need to be very careful about missing shots, because otherwise I'm just going to waste money. I think it's every 15th shot or something. We're up to 12, which isn't bad. Give me that berry. Ah, bugger. Oh, we got Godhead, though, for, for, for now. It's pretty good. Godhead Glass Cannon, though. It's a little scary. This is our first time since unlocking Godhead actually getting it, which is rather nice, obviously. Nice. We get some HP there. Are we good to go on this floor? I think we're good to go on this floor. Okay, I'm actually pretty happy with the reroll we got here. Blood Puppy ain't bad to have around. Chilling. Obviously Godhead, pretty amazing. Do you know what? Godhead plus Glass Cannon's kind of interesting too, because we can do some really wacky stuff with the huge shot it fires. Like, look at that. It just... It just covers an entire room. Eternal heart there, thank you. Glass cannon recharged during this room for some reason. I'm not quite sure why that is. I'm also not quite sure what's going on right now. I didn't get hit there, but I probably should have done. I was very unaware and not really paying attention. Oh, this is beautiful. This, if this run could stick around for some time, uh, we'd, we'd be uh, we'd be sitting pretty. We'd be sitting pretty. Reheated pizza's pretty good. Our HP's looking very nice right now. Can't complain about the HP. Mm. 
Okay, unfortunately, we're not able to do too much outside of... Uh, I don't know how I didn't get hit there. Okay, just about did it. Oh, dude. Tear size up, are you kidding me? Yes, please, tear size up. Okay. Uh, Devil Deal, yeah, no. Uh, we're going. Tear size up is, is pretty insane with, uh, with Godhead, because that just increases our, um, aura by a l by quite a lot. Not a great reheated pizza one there. Yeah, look at that aura size. Look at that aura, baby. Oh, <laughs> we've got spectral and piercing as well, so this is like even stronger than normal. Locust of War's good, but a little dangerous for me, to be honest. Sad bombs. There's a chest and a chest and a chest and a chest here. I'm not quite sure what's going on there. I don't know where that came from. Oh, dude, that's that's some spicy pepperoni right there. I don't know why I even fired there. That was stupid. I might get hit here, to be honest. This guy hits me quite a lot. Yeah. I kind of knew that was coming. That guy hits me all the goddamn time. I find it really hard to dodge some of his attacks. When enemies die, other enemies near them are downgraded. Nice. Yeah, this is this is not quite not quite the caliber that we're used to, which is a little upsetting. Not quite the caliber we're used to, but don't like this. Just write the story and don't let me die. We do have pride pin though. That's nice. Okay, I've re I've accidentally rerolled myself. I've got Godhead back. Little thing, can you open up, please? There you go. Godhead came back to me. Contraband? I'll take contraband. Cool room. Cool room. I think we've got um, um, Immaculate Heart. Yeah, we've got Immaculate Heart and Godhead. Pretty pretty good stuff. Sadly, no more Glass Cannon. That thing was uh, very spicy for us. Just keep going. I'm probably going to get hit by Bob's brain at some point. Seems to always be the case. Oh, what? Did I technically not finish this room? That's bullshit. Oh, chill out, my guy. Right. It's been a very good run as this guy, though, so far. All the way back this way. No worries, no worries. Interesting room. Didn't really have to face the design that had been put forth there, but... That's some horse shit right there. We've got Sacred Heart, Explosiva, Parasite. We've got some good stuff here as well. Although our damage seems to be pretty... Oh, our tier seems to be really small. Oh, we got Lemonhead, that's why. No, I got hit again straight away anyways. God damn it. Okay, this is also pretty good. We've been getting some real good, real good setups here. We'll take Gusty. I'm interested to see what the hell this tiny little secret room is here. This is confusing me. There seems to be a thin secret room here. Okay, it's not a thin secret room. The game just lied.
Good stuff. Oh my god. I don't know if I'm going to get hit here or not. But I'll try my best not to. Okay, doesn't matter. I got hit. I don't know what we've got going on here. Okay, it's gone. Oh god, it's gone again. I'm, I'm getting hit a lot right now. Hey, we got the Bible! <laughs> nice. That was useful. I don't know, my, my mod must not be working. I have a mod that's supposed to spawn this here, but it's not spawning it here right now. Um, Take that. I'm going to check in here. See wag one. Eh. I want to make it through without getting hit just so I've got this sun card for the next floor. In fact, I should just drop it. Yeah, there you go. I don't even know how to not get hit here. I also don't know what madness I've got going on here, but it seems good. Right. I think I'm fine on all of us. Contraband, I'm sorry. My contraband is contraband. Oh, damn. Oh, we got random spirit of acceptance. Hey, Godhead's back. With Prut on the? Oh, God, and Marks. Okay, this is not good. This is interesting. It's interesting, but it's not, it's not good. I don't know, it's kind of okay. It's weird. And it's gone. Bible's back there. King of Spades. Um, that meant to be what King of Spades does? God damn. Hey, it's Randy. What up, my little freak? The snailiest fella in all of town. Why's my fire rate so bad? Why my fire rate so bad? Oh god, I've got an itchy arm. One second. Oh. Oh, I just don't even know what happened there. We got Sacred Heart out of it though. Good old yum heart. Stick that in your dojo. Actually, not a bad thing to have, to be honest. The Emperor. Ooh. Oh, I got flight. What am I doing? Oh, I got mini bombs. Nice. Having the Emperor here. Very, very nice for the next floor because we have a good build. We can just roll with it. Okay. Where, where the hell am I going? How did I miss this door over here? I don't know how I did this. But I completely missed the fact that this existed. Just gotta watch out for Clutch's curse, because he will bomb everything given the opportunity. It does have Herming, so it's not super likely to hit me, but it can hit me, is the, is the sort of thing to note. Oh god! Yeah, it wasn't much avoiding that. Okay, what is going on right now? Uh, do I have Dr. Fetus? No. No, I don't. So what the fuck was with all those bombs? Oh my lord. We keep getting Furton. Oh my god.
I don't even know what to what to say about what's going on on screen right now. It's all kinds of fucking messed up. All right, give me that half red heart. I've lost a lot of HP here. But I have no real reason to lose. How'd I still end up with Clutch's Curse? This is a really weird one, because it's like very good but very dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> okay, just get hit like five times in a row, why don't you? That was pretty bad. Down we go. What have we ended up with here? Hmm. Not, not terrible. Not terrible. No soul heart, damn you. So far, not too bad. We've definitely had better thus far. We've also had worse. Have half decent damage. Oops, which he just yeeted on himself onto me. Damn it. We keep getting Sacred Heart. I'm, I mean, I'm pretty happy about it, but. I just wish I could get my health back up to a reasonably acceptable level. It's not great at the minute. Not great at the moment. Come on, game, drop us some HP. Oh, there was a half heart back there that I missed. You did drop me some HP. Where did that come from? Okay. I'm kind of hoping we can keep this build alive for a bit because this seems pretty strong. Damage wise, we're, we're looking good, all that sort of good stuff. Don't know where all they came from. I think they're my cherry bombs, maybe, is doing that. Don't exactly know how the cherry bombs work, but they seem to be having some something to do with uh, the red hearts we're getting. There we go, look. Okay, I like it. And we've got a little chat as well, actually, here. Giving us a little bit extra, so we might actually be able to get up to full HP here. Nice. And here's our boss. Okay, it is time. It is time. We shouldn't have too bad of a time here. I'm just gotta kind of hope for the best. Damage wise, things are good. Maybe Cherry Bomb will like drop us HP when we kill the maggots and stuff. Circle of Protection, doing exactly what it says on the tin. Protecting us a decent amount here. I've learnt to deal with this attack for the most part. It's not as bad as it used to be. I still, I gotta say, I'm still not gonna not get hit by it. I got hit then, but didn't get re-rolled for some reason, so... Not entirely sure why that is. So if I maybe walk into these cherry bombs, does something happen? No. Of course, we got a few bombs for the, uh... For the old rush tactic thing that he does. Doesn't seem to be wanting to do it at the moment. Kind of walked into that one. It's okay, we've got him nearly half dead. Circle of protection helps us a ton on this attack. Ah, bugger. We got... Cursed Eye. Okay, I just need to get hit. There you go. We had Cursed Eye. I'm not getting... I'm not getting launched out of this room at this stage. <laughs> I don't even know what we have right now. I don't see any tears. Am I able to fire right now? It doesn't look like I'm able to fire. Fire. 
Okay. Beautiful stuff. We got it done. Uh, that was a weird one. A lot of really good items in there. The angel deals helped us out a ton. Hope you guys did enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next one.